the armored dinosaurs or thyreophorans did not evolve at one point. They did not all appear in the Triassic period, nor did they all become extinct at the end Cretaceous extinction. These are members of the Ornithischian lineage, and so therefore they were preceded by the basal Ornithischians. And the earliest armored dinosaurs possessed much smaller amounts of armor than the later ones would have. Some of the earliest forms are even bipedal, such as Scatellosaurus. Later forms such as Scalidosaurus uh, became more top heavy and was probably quadrupedal. And then there are two great lineages of the armored dinosaurs. The stegosaurs, which were more common during the Jurassic period, these possessed a row of bony plates along their backs and a spiked tail. And then the ankylosaurs. The ankylosaurs can be subdivided into two groups, the nodosaurs, which were like the ankylosaurs but lacked a heavy tail club, and then the ankylosaurs, which possessed the heavy tail club. Both the nodosaurs and ankylosaurs possessed heavy shields of armor composed of many small fused bones.